Leslie Wexner possessed by a demon. He has the weirdest freaking article came out about him in New York Magazine of all places in 1985. It's called On Pins and Needles with Leslie Wexner. And that's a reference to his demon. He uses the Yiddish term, uh, the book, which is basically, is usually translated into English as demon. He claims it was joined with him as a child, went away during an unspecified amount of time. He has long had a vacation property in Colorado and he was climbing up a mountain near there and apparently like had a near death experience. He claims that this entity <laughs> clung to him yet again at that time. Towards the end of your article, you say, yeah, he self-identifies as the, the book. He, he says it looks like him and, and, and appears next to him and like tells him what to do and is there when he wakes up in the morning and when he goes, I mean, it's just like absurd to read. That's, That's the guy that bankrolled Epstein, dude. 